But whenever I would go to them, I would minister them with authority. Why? Because that's how we, that's what we saw in the Word. And I started realizing I am Jesus' representative, so I have to speak the way he did. He commanded, I'm going to command. So no matter what I do, if it's, if it's one person in front of me, I'm going to command. Body, be healed in Jesus' name. Do your job. Function. What am I doing? I'm telling it what I want it to do. Nothing special. I'm not, oh, Father, please make this body be healed. Please make this body do what it's supposed to do. It's not, no, he didn't say talk to me. He said speak to the mountain. He didn't say speak to me about the mountain. So I just speak to the mountain. I tell the problem, here, you're going to leave right now. Sickness, disease, go in Jesus' name. And then we just speak. Be healed. Tumor, dissolve, disintegrate, dis whatever it is. Whatever you want to happen, just speak the end result. That's what Jesus did. Jesus spoke the end result. I will come and heal him. He didn't say, I'll come and try. He spoke the end result. When he spoke about Lazarus, this, this sickness is not unto death. Right? And what, it wasn't unto death. He died, but guess what? It didn't end in death. It ended in a resurrection. Right? He always spoke the end result. So all you have to do is speak the end result. But you have to know what's in you. You have to know who's in you. You have to know the authority that you have. And the authority you have is the authority of Jesus. It's his authority. He didn't give you a piece of his authority. He gave you his authority. That's why you go in his name. Mm 